Well, you're faster than me, huh? Yeah, I gotta pace. We're done. All right. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> this recipe is submitted by Thomas. Why does Thomas have an H in it? Because it Because it would be <laughs> Thomas otherwise. Oh, I thought it was Thomas. So, Thomas, uh, a day at the beach. Day at the beach. Recipe. All right. Anytime Malibu's involved. If you say a day at the beach, what's the first alcohol you think of? No. It smells like yeah. the beach. Right. Oh, let me think. Let me think. Like uh, 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 rum. Some, some kind of rum, obviously. Some kind of rum. Here, Probably take Malibu. some kind of rum. Put it in here. We're going to do an ounce of Malibu. I'm using Malibu black because once you go black, you, you are never going to go back. Because this is the best right. Malibu version there is. That's what right. I've heard. I like to think it's, that some people have come back. It's a, <laughs> <laughs> it's a little sweeter. Uh, no, I, I take that back. It's not as sweet. It's alcohol here. Um, how right. hollier. It's heavier. Hmm. It's more of a round flavor. Has more depth to it than just say. It's not quite as square. Yeah, as, as that other stuff there. Do Malibu I have black. One Boom for the black. We're gonna do a half ounce. So we get a whole ounce of Malibu, a half ounce of amaretto. This this time I'm using amaretto di di Sorono. I was gonna say di Amore, but I'm not using that. Oh, they're both the same color. Because last time I used Luxardo. She wasn't even here and she knew. She knows. I saw the bottle when I walked in. Oh, this wicked fucking smart. All right. We're doing four ounces of orange juice. Yep. And then at the end, we're going to dash it with some uh, some granite. Because I wicked smart. Wicked fucking smart, kid. That's right. Looks a lot like orange juice. Perfect. It means we did it right. Yep. A little darker. A little darker than orange juice. It's a little spiced orange juice. A little darker. A little spiced action. A little spiced action. You shake it. Hey, Jennifer, you share a new one? Oh, you got the pink in. He's going in first. Oh, I just left it there. Those are pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Pink, yeah. One? Yeah, you're going to wet yourself, though. It's okay. Ice block! It's a cool blend. Colossal it's ice block. I, I, I feel like I fit in if I wet myself. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> it makes you enjoy the crowd. Everyone else is doing it. Oh, All the cool the kids are peeing ice. their pants. I, I could have used the circle ice. Do I have one of those? I yeah. like the square ice. The square ice is pretty cool. I do. Cool. I, I could have. I'm an idiot. But yeah, we do have circle okay, ice. You're a level two idiot. I'm a level two idiot. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, you're a level two have... idiot. I wanted to be. I said, more... It's okay, you're a lovable idiot. Oh, I wanted to be a, like an 11, 12 multi class fighter. We um, don't have any in the store, so we don't want to broadcast those anyway. Yeah, I sold out. Like I didn't even advertise them. Round ice? Just, yeah, they all sold out. Well, and I went to go buy more, and the distributor's like, well, we're not going to get them for two months. I'm like, dude! He's like, yeah, we didn't know either that it was going to be like wow, a big hit. Round ice is kind of cool. So those big square ice. Round yeah. ice. <laughs> yeah, we, no, we actually sell a lot of these, but they're not sold out because they've been around for a while. Yeah. Oh, big square ice? That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Oops. What are you doing? He's drizzled grenadine. Yeah, but it's not... Why? It's It's because it's supposed... to the bottom. I think it's supposed to make the... Uh, I think it's going to... It's supposed to make the um the drizzle. tequila sunrise effect. Kind of is. It, yeah, but it's... Dude, I mean, how much of this do you need? Well, you're going to make it super sweet. Stop. <laughs> well, man! That's orange juice not It brown. says drizzle grenadine to make a tequila sunrise effect. So I guess that's it. Oh, look at the, the grenadine. I drizzled it onto the ice and it froze and now it's sitting on the top. Did that's you review awesome. Malibu Black, Derek? What do I, who, huh? Did you review Malibu Black? Uh, yeah, I think so. Ooh. Oh, look, it's all right there. It's a different drink from bottom. That's weird, it's like yeah. completely red. See, if you turn it upside, mm. no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> if you look at the bottom. I was not expecting it to just be so not like. Well, the, the good grenadine there is a little bit yeah. thicker than, yeah. yeah, so it's, it's got a different density. I was saying, oh, you, are my, you are my density. Destiny. Hmm? Keep that away from me, man. Not I good? Like that song. I guess that's you are my density? Well, I was yeah. quoting Back to the Future when he's like playing Sir Nod de Bergiac. You are my destiny. You are my density. Um, Colossal uh, Ice Cube Trace. They make this. No, actually. Uh, uh, that, is a, a that is a. That is a. That's tasty. That is one I would. I, my pants would be off by the end of night drinking that stuff. Your pants would be off by the end of night. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> you were feeding my drink again? <laughs> Maybe. You, you're trying to get it to get the tequila sunrise effect? Mm. Oh, that's good. That's pretty oh, good. That's good. Oh, that's good. That, that good there, boy. I gotta like that, that boy. There's the tequila oh, sunrise uh, effect. Oh, there we go. Hunt some crocodiles now. Hunt some crocodiles. Chew them. Chew them. Chew them. Chew them. That's what he says. He says, chew them. 
I guess we should probably describe the awesomeness, but I can't. It's orangey and fruity. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Done. No. Oh! Done. Amaretto, orange juice. I'm telling you. Yeah. No, I'm. That's pick, it. I'm picking up what you're putting down with the amaretto and the OJ. I mean, there is some. There is um some some. Not as much coconut as I would think, but the coconut arrives way late in the game. Like, after you're like, the oh, that's so awesome. And you're sitting there like thinking that, about it. You're like, oh. Coconut. After the liquid is still in your mouth and all the other flavors are gone, the coconut stays. Yeah, and it just lingers. Yeah. And you're like, oh, coconut. Yeah. Day at the beach. I'm having a day at the beach in my mouth right now. Not bad, Thomas. No. This is, this is, a, this is a pretty nice drink. It's better than a tequila sunrise because, well... <laughs> is that defensive drinking? <laughs> block him out. <laughs> Elbow to the head. Come near me. Um, Boot to the head. Nah, nah. It's better than tequila sunrise because it it's sweet. Tequila sunrise has yeah. tequila. I like tequila, but I, I, it's boring mm, in tequila sunrise. Tequila it's like a screwdriver, but with tequila. Ugh. Rum is so much better than tequila. Right. Uh, rum, rum goes so well with fruit drinks. It does. It really this is and, and fruit. A lot of times, like rum in fruit drinks... The rum is so overdone, right? Mm -hmm. Where I think the rum is like almost secondary to the amaretto here, right? All the rum's doing in this case it's is giving coconut. Yeah, it's transporting the coconut to your mouth. Yeah. And it just happens to have alcohol. Yeah, it's not like a rum punch where it's like just boom in your face. Right. You're like, you're sitting there and all of a sudden you're like, oh, I'm lying on the ground looking at stars. Wow. All I did was have five or six of those rum punches. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so fucked up. <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. Let me tell you what. No. Yeah. It, I could make this into a punch and yeah. everybody would be floored. But I think it would take some time. It would take some time. Yeah, it's because it's only like an ounce or two ounces, not even, an ounce and a half of actual alcohol. Right. And it's like if you low. you had six in a short period of time, it wouldn't take time. No. No. But this is <laughs> what? 35% alcohol with DiSerrano? Probably about the same. So it's not like. Why am I looking at the back? Oh, 28%. Okay, so. Caramel color. It tells you that. It's like, hey, we made this look very old. Yeah, so since there's color. less of that than there is this, the, the drink is probably 30% alcohol, 35, 28. And there's four ounces yeah. of orange juice. And then the, the grenadine, using a good grenadine is nice because it adds sweetness, but it doesn't taste like high fructose syrup. corn syrup. Yeah. Like it's, it just, it adds like a little bit of fruit, pomegranate, orange, coconut. It's all the things you mm. like about life, all in a single little container. Totally. Don't oversell it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got a question today. Really? I agree though. The, the with like the Fee Brothers grenadine instead yeah. of like your typical like roses or right. whatever the which is just a sweet stuff is. Did it get to me? I'm gonna get it. What is it? It's a mosquito. Mosquito. Oh, that's not the thing I was looking at earlier. Yeah. Why are there bugs in here? I don't know. All right. Um, but but yeah, the the good grenadine definitely adds a flavor. And like a the color. cheap grenadine and the color. It looks good at starter. I think the cheap grenadine would add a better color. But it, it would be a, a more artificial color, you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. It's, it's <laughs> it like a neon be. color. Look at that. Um, see what what armoretto do you like? What armoretto do you like? I'm fairly sure I once asked that, but we got Di Sorono. Let's see, there's the Luxardo. Right, more fans now. Um, I got more fans, I, don't I know guess. If that's true, but we'll make it up. Anyway. Probably got sure. different fans. Yeah, maybe the other guy just left us because, like, what's this asshole's problem? Luxardo, Di Sorono, Di Amore. Uh, there's probably a couple other ones out there. I can't think of any of the other names, but I'm sure there's at least one or two other fairly popular amarettos. What, which one do you like the best, and why? Well, what makes it better? Not it's better. No, like what is it that makes it? Why is that red now? <laughs> you? Uh, it looks like ruby red grapefruit juice now. It does actually very much like ruby red. That would actually disturb me to drink. I'd be like, ooh. Like Yes, that looks like bad pee. If that's what your pee looks like, <laughs> drop what you're doing and go to the hospital right now. <laughs> you need to yeah. call the doctor. Something's wrong. <laughs> oh, it's tasty. Um, all right, I'm going to let Jennifer have a little sip of this, but oh, there thanks, you go. Thanks, thanks for that. Pick your amaretto. Otherwise, well, I'm not. No. <laughs> He's got the elbow. <laughs> I got the elbow. <laughs> Let's try it. So I would suggest it's one ounce of Malibu, half ounce of amaretto, four ounce of orange juice. Oh. I would totally just double the ingredients because you're going to need it. Yeah, you're going to want some more of that. Pick your favorite amaretto. Write it below. Also, what's your favorite summer drink? If you guys don't have any opinions on amaretto, whatever that stuff is. Yeah. Behind there, this is a sign. It goes to awesome drinks. No, everydaydrinkers.com. You can go to awesomedrinks.com, though. I get highly cool encourage shakers. that. You can probably get some grenadine there, right? You can get grenadine. You can get neon <laughs> shakers stuff. of four different colors. Uh, you can get the wide mouth glow sh sh ball glass, and you can get colossal ice cube trays. Oh, you can get cocktail gators. Oh, crap, you can get major cups. You can get everything there. Ah! <laughs> the only thing you can't get is alcohol. And you better end 
Alright. What did you know how to drink? <laughs>